And now, your Storm Team 2 forecast with meteorologist Tara Hastings. Well, we are going to see mostly clear skies tonight. Temperatures will be falling into the lower 50s at 9 o'clock, 47 degrees at 11 o'clock. And tomorrow morning, we're going to see another cool start down to 39 degrees in the morning. Mostly sunny skies for the afternoon, up to 59 by lunchtime. And we'll see those highs top out right around 65 degrees. So clear and chilly conditions expected tonight. We are going to see those lows once again in the 30s for most locations, around 39 degrees here in Dayton. And we're going to experience some cool nights the next couple of nights and some warm afternoons. Amy sent us this picture from Fort Loramie. It was a frosty start to the morning. Many locations got down to about 36 degrees officially in Dayton. We made it up to 62 this afternoon. And tomorrow, we'll hit those highs right around 65 degrees after starting out in the upper 30s once again. Next weekend, though, it looks like that cooler air is going to move in. So it's definitely going to feel a little bit more like November. Right now, we're seeing mostly sunny skies from our SVG motor camera located in Greenville where it's 60 degrees right now. We're at 56 degrees in Troy. It's 57 in Springfield, 60 in Urbana, and we're sitting at 56 right now in Wilmington. Officially at Dayton International Airport, it's 56 degrees. Very light winds out of the south and southwest at about 7 miles per hour. Nothing happening here on Live Doppler 2 HD. We have our network of radar scanning the skies, not picking up any rain. We have high pressure nearby, and that gave us all that sunshine today. We have a few high-level clouds off to the west of us, but that's just just about it. We are going to remain dry here for the end of the weekend. We'll show you in our future track forecast model here tomorrow morning, still under the influence of high pressure, meaning mostly sunny skies pretty much all day long with those highs climbing into the mid and possibly even upper 60s. During the day on your Monday, we're going to start off with clear skies at 8 o'clock in the morning and then once again, mostly sunny conditions all day long. Tonight, we'll get down to 39 degrees, mostly clear skies. It will be another chilly night with light and variable winds. And for the day tomorrow, will pop up to 65 degrees, mostly sunny skies. And of course, don't forget we have to fall back. We're going to head back to standard time so you gain an extra hour of sleep. But watch what it does to our sunrise and sunset time. So the sun will rise here. 7:12 tomorrow morning and set right around 5:30. So keep that in mind. 67 degrees on Monday and on Tuesday we're going to be tracking a cold front that will head this way. So on election day it looks like for the first part of the day we will be dry, but by the time the polls close we do have a chance for some showers to head this way. We're going to keep an eye on it for you. Right now we're going to see our high right around 66 degrees and heading into Wednesday we'll see temperatures right around 60. There's that cooler weather I was talking about. For next weekend, look at that. We're going to see a cool pool of air push down. Friday, we'll see our highs right around 55 degrees. And next weekend, it looks like, it looks like highs will only be in the 40s. Oh, we're going to start going down. Oh, we are. It's going to yes. feel like November. It will. <laughs> Thanks. Hatch is here with